And that's, I get kind of uncomfortable after these shootings. Everybody says, do something, do something. It's just this sort of ambiguous, broad slogan now. I say, do something, do something. Well, I agree that we should do something, but the problem is when you, when you say to Washington, do something, yeah, they'll do something. They, they love doing things, but the question is, is it the right thing? Is there any, do they have, do they have the authority to do it? I mean, these are all questions we should ask. I think though, if we want to do something, we should, we should probably start on a really more localized level, like in our own homes. So um, if I, if I r right now want to do something about this, I know one thing I can do. I can, you know, with, I can be present and active in my children's lives. I can regulate their access to the internet. I can try to make sure that they do not become these numb, desensitized zombies. Um, you know, that's something I can do. I don't have to wait for Washington to give me the go ahead. I can do it right now. If we all did that, I mean, if we all did that, if we all just simply, uh, if, if we all raised our own kids, stayed home, stayed married, um, didn't spend as much time on the internet, didn't spend as much time watching TV, playing video games, if we, if we just made those, if we all, if all of us made that change right now, a lot of these problems would almost disappear overnight. Um, right. Well, it's like I said so before, it, really it all comes back to the family. Strong families equal a strong society. We've allowed our family units to disintegrate and there, and uh, after, after that, subsequently, our society has somewhat disintegrated.